An ongoing blizzard has covered much of Spain with an unusual amount of snow, killing at least four people, and leaving thousands trapped in cars or at train stations and airports, causing all services to be suspended. The National Weather Agency said that as of 7 a.m., snowfall in Madrid had reached levels unseen in half a century. More than 50 centimeters of snow fell in the Spanish capital, according to the weather agency. The bodies of a man and a woman were found by the emergency services of the Andalusian region after their car was washed away by an overflowing river near the city of Huangirola. The Interior Ministry said a 54-year-old man was also found dead in Madrid under a large pile of snow. A homeless man died of hypothermia in the northern city of Zaragoza, the local police said. According to Interior Minister Fernando Grande Marlaska, as of evening, Spanish security forces had rescued all the people trapped in the vehicles more than 1,500. Authorities have warned that some regions will experience more than 24 hours of continuous snowfall due to a strange combination of stagnant cold air mass over the Iberian Peninsula and the arrival of warmer storm phenomena from the south. In the coming days, the storm will be followed by a sharp drop in temperature. Transport Minister José Luis Avalos has warned that the snow will turn to ice and we will enter a situation possibly more dangerous than what we have now. He added that helping those in need is a priority, as well as securing the supply chain for food and other basic goods. The hurricane has surpassed the most pessimistic forecasts we have had, added Avalos. The international airport will be closed for at least 24 hours after a blizzard hit cars and workers trying to clear snow from the runways, Avalos said. All trains, both commuter and long-distance passenger trains, as well as railway lines between the south and northeast of the country, have been suspended, the railway operator said. The storm caused serious disruptions or closed more than 650 roads, which encouraged people to stay indoors and avoid all non-essential travel, according to Spain's transit authorities. More than 100 roads were still impassable for almost 24 hours after a hurricane covered the central part of the country with snow.